Greetings, this is Edward Ojambo. In this tutorial, if else if statements will be used to execute a block of code in Python, this is brought to you from the jumboshop.com learning Python course and learning PHP course. So all you do is once you log in, you go to my account and you pick paid content. Once you log in, we're right now in chapter five. The first thing we did last time was the if statements. So today we're gonna do the else if statement so a conditional statement tests a given condition and returns either true or false therefore an if else if statement is a boolean expression python can be compiled from source at github python can be installed from downer binaries i'm going to use the web ide that which includes python so down here um, this is a web ide just type in the code here and then we can start Okay, so let's begin here. We we'll just type in some variables. Num1 equals 5. Num2 equals 31. Num3 equals 55. Num4 equals 33. Let me say if num1 is greater than 55. Print num1 is greater than 55. Now we use else if, it's, so it's else. That's how you do it in Python. So num3 is greater than 11. So print num3 is greater than 11. Then we're going to do a complex, uh, no logical one. So if num1 is greater than num2, or num1 equals 55, I'm using two spaces here. So we say num1 is greater than num2, or num1 is equal. 255. Now again we use the else if num3 greater than num4 or num3 equals 55. Two spaces again. Let's say num3 is greater than num4 or num3 is equal to 55. Okay, finally we say we do the complex one, so we say num1 is greater than or equal to 6, and num1 is less than equal to 4. So we print num1 is greater than or equal equal to Six and num one is less than or equal to four. Else, if num three is greater than or equal to thirty-three and num three less than or equal to fifty-five. two spaces, then we say num3 is greater than or equal to 33, and num3 is less than or equal to 55. Okay, looks like I didn't make any mistakes, hopefully. 
Then we have the compile here. It says line 15. Oh, I put an extra one there. Does it belong? See, num3 is greater than 11, num3 is greater than num4, or num3 is equal to or 255, num3 is greater than or equal to 33, and num3 is less than or equal to 55. So that's the end of the tutorial. Uh, the full article is available on jumbo.com slash python hyphen if hyphen else if hyphen statement. You can see all the code snippet is here. These are the command statements we used today. And here are the screenshots from the web IDE. This is the output from the web IDE. This is the video watching right now. You can learn Python uh, on a jumbo dot com your course and also learn PHP on a jumbo shop dot com it's a course and there are also ebooks are available on Amazon so and then of course if you want one-on-one uh, -on -one tutorials or something else so jumbo services dot com all the links are in the description or you can just go to references and click on each of them here so first one we're going to do is uh, if we go to the store I see there's a learning Python course or learning PHP course. And so you remember there's a promo code until the end of 2024, promo code school, S-C-H-O-L, 20% off. So Python, why learn Python? Well, it's used for emerging technologies such as AI, machine learning, learning and robotics, and much more. You saw as an example I used for, for Blender 3D to render 3D text, but you can also use it for 3D modelings. And as you just saw, uh, this is similar to, there's also PHP. PHP is very popular for web applications and platforms such as WordPress. And again, it's very similar, there's syntax, and then you can simply just type in the web IDE and you can compile it. Now, if you prefer to, you go to Amazon, you just search, search for Edward or Jumbo if you don't click the links below. And you click on my name you can get the learning python ebook it doesn't come with web ide and the compiler uh, you can get it for free if you have kindle unlimited or you can just purchase it outright same uh, learning php uh, you can also just get it from amazon for your reader then we we'll go to jumboservices.com uh, this is if you need a a website or if you want to migrate your website or different platforms maybe you want e-commerce maybe you want PCI compliance or maybe you're hacked and you need to uh, remove the malicious code I can help you all with that uh, maybe you just need a different application it could be desktop mobile or just web all the major platforms Linux Android Windows Mac OS and iOS and as I touched on earlier today is maybe you want a custom-made tutorial uh, online just for maybe it's office suites programming maybe how to use software uh, it's all here now if you're in north america you use this toll-free number if you're if you want to do a direct dial it's this number here or you can go to the contact page fill in the information and get back to you within a day thank you